All right, we've started off the day strong. We went to Cookies in Golden City. Again, we actually ate there twice. Once in the daytime of yesterday for like lunch. And then we went there back there this morning for some breakfast. We are 10 miles down the road. We are close to the city of Pittsburgh, which we're gonna get a hotel for the night. Hotel, motel, probably a Super 8. All right, day 31 on the road. One month and one day. Well, 31 could technically be a month too. Anyways, we're headed out, me and Shlomo, he's up here. He just dropped a water bottle. That's actually why we stopped, but I'm gonna drink some water. We're gonna get going. It's pretty bright out. It's getting kind of hot today. I'm sweating pretty bad. Uh, it's pretty flat right now, not a bunch of hills. The part of Missouri that we have been through have, have, have all been hills. So um, today we crossed the border into Kansas. So we'll probably see a sign along our way, hopefully at least. And so yeah, that's why today's a big day is that we're getting into Kansas for the first time. It's gonna be Pittsburgh, Kansas. And so uh, other than that, I, I'm just uh, kind of hot, kind of tired and uh, ready to get to Pittsburgh. So let's do it. Field mixed with the cornfields and the windmills. This is actually a really nice ride. All right, guys, we have passed into Kansas and there was no big sign, and I thought there was gonna be a sign. So I'm gonna make a sign right now, and I want you to pretend I'm doing my dance in front of a sign as I put it on the screen. Welcome to Kansas. Shlomo, are you happy? We switch maps to the next Trans Am map tomorrow in Girard, but today, tonight I should say, we stay in Pittsburgh. So feeling good, Kansas, here we come. Missouri, it was good. We didn't really like your hills that much, but we also loved them at the same time. All right, we are at Tailwind Cyclist Incorporated Bike Shop. I'm getting my chain replaced and my wheel trimmed, and Shlomo's just along for the ride. I want to have my brake checked. Oh, he's having his brake pads checked. Cool. Yeah. Okay. And uh, inside here, of course, this is a, a nice bike shop. They have sold all their bikes. They're doing a lot of business. And Roger, the owner here, is working hard. He uh, got me right on the stand, and he is uh, fixing the wheel as we, well, he's chewing the wheel as we speak. And um, yeah, so we're having a really good experience here. Definitely recommend Tailwind Cyclists Incorporated Bike Shop in Pittsburgh, Kansas. Keep that in mind when you're running through. So I am in Pittsburgh now. I'm taking a walk tonight. We have a super early morning tomorrow. We're probably gonna be up by about five out the door by six. We don't have to pack up tents or anything, so usually that makes the process of getting out the door a lot quicker. We stayed at the Holiday Lodge, which is one of the recommendations on the um, Adventure Cycling Association map and nap, map and app. Um, Pittsburgh is a nice little town. There's a college here of about five, 6,000 kids and a big high school. The bike shop in town, which was Tailwind Cyclists, was a super great bike shop. They are on the recommended list. Please go there if you're in Pittsburgh, Kansas. Uh, totally cool. And now I'm just exploring the town, having a good time, you know, uh, it, on my nights. <clears throat> I try to see the town at least a little bit. I'll go out on my bike every once in a while or I'll take a walk. Uh, sometimes taking a walk is a little bit better of an option, of course, because you know, you've been biking all day. 
but uh, tomorrow we got about 60 miles and then the next day we're gonna have to do 60 again to get to where we want to be there's minimal services on this portion of the route so we're gonna have to stock up on water and make sure that we can get uh, water on the way uh, but it shouldn't be a big issue we're just gonna keep pounding out the miles and uh, sometimes you got to do big days these last two days we've only done 35 to 40 miles a day anyways so we're kind of due for some bigger days so we're gonna do 60 miles each day and that should get us a lot further down the road and oh, we're gonna see a lot more of Kansas as well and I'll try to keep the videos coming this is the end of day 31 not too much of an interesting day but hopefully you guys enjoyed a little bit of the scenery thanks for watching we will talk to you guys soon